Hola, estudiantes. ¿Cómo están ustedes? Los mandatos regulares. You're going to learn how to tell people what to do in Spanish. This is the best chapter ever. It is. If you're really interested, the book has this quick explanation of how to do affirmative to command. So basically now the bad news is you're only going to know how to command one person that is your friend. So you can't command your teachers yet and you can't command two people at a time. But, but you can tell your little brother or sister what to do. And you can tell one friend at a time what to do. This is fun. Okay. You, you should have a sheet that looks like this. Yes, I'm sorry it's teeny tiny, but we told you, you can write your notes below it if you like to write big, okay? So these are the affirmative two commands, and it's really, really easy. You just use the third person singular form of the verb in the present tense. So that's the L, A, A, Usted form, so easy. So what would bailar be? Oh, um, baila. Oh, present tense, that's a long time ago. Yes. And even though it's easy, there are eight irregulars. Yeah, so you have to memorize these, but we actually have some fun ways for you to do that. So okay. here they are. Okay. Now would be a good time to pause, write them down, and you'll get to the song in a second to practice. Make sure you also write down the verbs that go along with them. Mm -hmm. All right, it's time to sing. I know this is everyone's favorite time. You can replay this part as many times as you want and sing along with me. The song lyrics are actually on the back of your sheet, and they're even teenier, tinier, but they're still there. So, the song goes to the melody of Twinkle Twinkle. We have ten pone ven sol asti se, last but not least is our friend ve. Ten er pone er ven ir sol ir aser desir ser and ir. Ten pone ven sol asti se, last but not least is our friend ve. Yay! I just clapped for myself because nobody else was here to do it. That was, that was really good, Melissa. Thank nice you. job. Thank you very Bien much. Hecho. You should probably memorize that one. It'll get you all those regulars, all eight of them. Yes. Okay, kids. So now we just have some examples that you can write down. And again, if you don't have space on that grid, just write them below. Okay? So we've got escuchar, which is escucha. Listen. And irse which is go away. That's a good one to probably know it's for your really little sibling. Good. Bete. So if you notice, we didn't specifically mention this yet. You take and conjugate ear, which is a regular to ve, our friend ve. And the te, because it's a two command, we take that and we attach it to the end. So when we're commanding people to do things, if it's reflexive, you attach a te to the end. Excellent. Okay, kids, jugar, juega. And poner say, why'd you give me all the reflexives? So pon is the irregular and te is attached to the end. Ponte los zapatos. Put on your shoes. Mm -hmm. Okay, kids. Leer. Read. Le. Ear. Ve. That was one of our regulars. Bailar. Baila. Dance. Comer. Come. Nobody has to command me to do that. Come las verduras. Ah, oh, they do have to do that. Yes, eat your vegetables, kids. Vive en paz. Live in peace. That's a good one. Empezar. Empieza. So you notice that's a stem changing verb. Again, we're just using the third person singular, the L, A, A, Usted form of the verb. So we do have the stem change there. Yeah. Here we have a few examples from the real world. The good news is your tarea, your asignatura for showing that you've watched this is just to fill in that chart. So this is just for fun. Ha, ven acá, un besito. Come here for a little kiss. I just thought that was cute. Oh, that's cute. Baila. Como si nadie te viera. Dance as if no one was watching. Oh, yeah, that's a good motto. That is. Cuando te digan estudia, no hagas nada. When they tell you to study, we, when we tell you to study, do it. But this one says don't do it because it means es tu día. It's your day. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> okay, and we're going to leave you with this. Just hazlo. Do it. Do it. And I just like that little kitty in Jose. Yeah. <laughs> Cuando todo falle, abraza a tu perro. When all else fails, hug your dog. Oh, or tu gato. <laughs> Adios.